In this section, I'm gonna talk about adjusting levels, specifically in symphony. So I'm working on the same shot that I had earlier, and you can see the levels are, need some work. So I'm gonna to go to my workspaces color correction, just like I did in Media Composer, and now I have my symphony color correction tool set. As you can see, very quickly, it has a, a lot more options in here. So the first, right, we have HSL, both in Media Composer and Symphony, but in, in uh, Symphony, I, have, I can work with highlights, midtones, and shadows. Same with, I have hue offsets, but again, I now have a master, and then in my, and I have Luma ranges, which is not available at all in Media Composer. I also have channels, which is not available in Media Composer, right? Levels, not available in Media Composer. Curves, and then secondary, which is also not available in Media Composer. So I have a far superior color correction tool set. For this example, I'm gonna work on the levels. And now I can, inside of levels, I can work with a number of different color spaces, right? I'm gonna work on my master, and I can make this adjustment to this shot very quickly, very easy. And it's very sort of a Photoshop style of, of uh, adjusting the levels. It makes it very easy to work with. And you can see the power of working with levels and how you can do just really fine, you know, detailed adjustment inside of Symphony that just simply aren't, isn't available inside of Media Composer. And so that's an example of how you'd use levels inside of Symphony.